Are you ready to get financially fit? Hey guys, it's Jason for Happy Money, Happy Life, where I share interviews, reviews, and experiments to help you master money and live your best life. Today, I'm really excited to share with you an interview with Shannon McClay, the founder of The Financial Gym in New York City. Shannon is a former financial advisor turned entrepreneurial change maker offering people to meet with a financial trainer to help with managing money better, pay off debt, or earn more money to help you achieve your goals. You're not going to want to miss this interview with Shannon McClay. Let's head on over. I want us to walk people through your, your concept for the financial gym because I think it's amazing. Um, your focus is helping people kind of manage money, but talking about it through like the relationship with money, emotions, feelings, and thoughts, and then giving actionable advice based on that relationship. Yeah, I mean, I used to be a financial advisor at Merrill Lynch, and I like to say helping rich people get richer, um, and that's a great job for some people, but I saw this need for people who didn't have 250000 in assets to work on their money and work with a human being instead of a website or an app. Websites and apps are great for the DIYer, but not everybody's a DIYer. And when I was at Merrill, people were like, I'll pay you to help me with my money. And I didn't have a way to take their money, but I wanted to help them and figure it out. And the thing is that I've realized over the last four years of building this is that money's so emotional. People's financial journeys are all different and unique. It's not like I can create an AI app, which believe me, VC investors <laughs> wanted me to be a bot. They wanted me to be an app. They wanted me to be tech. And I said, no, you need human beings. You need a space. Because the two words we hear here all the time are fear and shame. I'm afraid I'm never going to pay off my student loan debt. Or I'm ashamed that I make $50,000 a year. I should be making more. I'm ashamed to make $300,000 a year and I have $100,000 of credit card debt. Or I have nothing saved. The fear and shame are two highly charged emotions. And when you think about all the people walking around, I'm sure people are watching this because I've said it in different groups and I've said fear and shame and I, to a crowd and I get a lot of head nodding. And imagine walking around feeling that. Like in your head, you're like this around your money. Where do you go? Like where do you go to release the fear and shame? Where do you go to figure out and feel empowered? To literally like shoulders down, like I'm in control of my money and I've got a plan and I'm going somewhere. You yeah. go to the financial gym. <laughs> I mean, like, if you think about it, right, because money is personal, we talk about money is personal, but then we make it very impersonal if we just push everyone to apps, to websites, yeah. and then we want to speak with someone on the phone, and we don't really know whom we're speaking with. Yeah, or do they know my story? Do they know that, like, I go shopping because I'm depressed about living at home with my, my family because I can't afford to move out because I'm ashamed I'm living at home and I'm 32 years old? Um, you know, who's going to understand that storyline? That's why it was so important for me to create this, that I have a team of financial trainers, not financial advisors. And, and they're essentially financial planners, but they're wearing jeans and t-shirts. They are so not judgmental. We, don't, we always say, we don't care how you got here. We don't care what you look like. We just care about getting you where you wanna go. That's it. Helping people get to where they, they wanna go yeah. and not kind of like this predefined path. Yeah. So, oh yeah, max out your 401k, pay off all your student loan debt. Anybody can say that. And yes, that's great advice for a very cookie cutter approach, but people aren't cookie cutter. And we have clients who, you know, maybe they don't want to ever really retire or maybe that travels, like travels our number one goal for our clients. And, and they want to prioritize that over maxing out their 401ks. I don't think that's the worst thing in the world because you know what happens? They get that travel bug out there or they we have a plan for travel and they actually still save for retirement because we're prioritizing travel now instead of you know just adding on credit card debt and making it work in, by any means possible. We actually have a plan for them and putting their money where they really value instead of just spending it, wasting it all over the place. I'm sure you're very proud of what you've accomplished in a very short period of time. It's on my Instagram profile, and I think pretty much anywhere. If, I, if somebody read my bio in like a group, I say that I'm the CEO of the world's greatest financial services company, and there's no bravado in that. Like that is, I mean, it's just true because I have a team of people, my team of trainers. They literally, their clients are not numbers. Their clients are not assets. Their clients are not their debt. Their clients have names. It's. It's Joy, it's Bridget, it's Susan, it's Bob. They, their clients have names. 
they know their clients' goals. When we speak in our team meetings, we're talking about our clients and what they want to do. And all my team does all day long is help figure out how we get our clients where they want to go. That's it. I do want you guys to know that Shannon is also the host of a podcast, Martinis and Your Money. And so with that, I wanted to... Cheers. Cheers. Congratulations. Thank you. And uh, thank you very much. And can you please share with everyone where they can find more information? Yep. You can find us on financialgym.com, on the financial gym on Instagram, and find out more. I always tell people schedule a free 15 minute call, especially if you're feeling fear and shame. Don't. Life's yeah. too short to feel that way. Yes, please. Take care. Bye. Bye. Cheers. I know that was a very short interview. It's a glimpse on the wonderful, amazing things that Shannon is doing that change the lives of people all across the country. So make sure you check out financialgym.com to learn more about the financial gym and to learn how you can get financially fit. Thank you so much. And remember to subscribe below to get some more amazing content to help you master money and live your best life. This Shannon and I go back a couple of years or, or three years or so. I think almost four. four. But who's counting? <laughs> who's counting? <laughs> but her journey has been really amazing. So I'm, I'm especially excited to be here in the grand opening of this amazing space. Yeah. What is this? Like three, four thousand square feet? Four thousand square feet. Four. But again, who's counting? <laughs> yeah. so, this is Jason. This is Happy Money, Happy Life.